What's your day on that? I'll have to plead guilty if I gotta work because I can't take the board to take the day off, you goddamn asshole! Now just give me the goddamn thing, let me get out of here. I did do nothing wrong, and I know I did. Now let me get the fuck out of here. I gotta get I ain't in no hurry, but I did want to get some kills for my dog. It's just about ready to get get the fuck out of here, give me that. Can I explain it to you, sir, so you'll know what you need to do? I know what I do. You're ripping me off, and I didn't deserve it because I did do nothing wrong. You'll probably set that pipe while driving right back and forth, get someone in the 40 miles of whatever the frig it is. I never saw the sign. I saw it 55, and I was doing 57. That's all I know. Now, just give me the goddamn thing, and I'll look at the date. If I'm working, I'll pay the fucking fine because I can't afford to take a day off. And if I'm not working, I'll plead not guilty because I know fucking well I'm not guilty. There. Now, are you a state or local? Looks like you're a state trooper. Get back and pick up some more guys and run up the friggin' deficit on, 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 on a working man. Just give me the damn thing and let me get out of here. Well, I need you to do a sign the X so I can explain this to you. There ain't no explaining. I got picked up for speeding before. You're guilty and you pay the fine and hope your insurance don't go up and you try not to speed the next time. And that's what I've been trying to do for four or five years, and it's worked damn good until I run into you, you asshole. Green copies for your record, sir. I don't... All right. White copy needs to be mailed in within 20 days. Okay. Make sure you read the... I can't uh, read, and I put this stuff away. I get bills in the mail all the time. I don't even look at them. $7 glasses here. All right, just tell me what I do. Lincoln Court? No. Where? Read the instructions here. This says you have 20 days to respond to this summons. Read the back of this hard copy. This will explain how you can have a trial if you want. On the back, that will explain it. Attaches an envelope. See? Put a stamp on that. You mail that in. I don't They'll mind tell you what to do. Well, I can afford the stamp. The fine's right here, sir. It's $137.50. If you don't pick this up, sir, I'm going to summon you for littering. I'll pick the goddamn... I'm under... Are you fucking crazy? I wasn't even speeding, you goddamn asshole! A hundred and some dollars? Jesus fucking ain't Christ! There's some more right there. I've never heard of a phone like that in my life, you goddamn asshole! You fucking asshole! Let me get the fuck out of here, son, you goddamn miserable fucking... Jesus Christ! I don't mind, I feel bad for the guys out of work, and I pay my goddamn state taxes a good fucking bunch, too, let me tell you. I'm giving you a warning on the failure to produce insurance. That's expired. Didn't I give you another one? No. My wife told me it was expiring today. She went and paid her cash, and all the expired on the 10th. Hot. Today's the 16th. That's six days ago. The, uh, the bill was due today, okay? Whatever the date on the bill due, I apparently have paid... Matter of fact, I don't know I a uh, copy. Do you want your license and registration? Of course I do. Well, anyway, I can reduce the insurance. I probably got to hear... Uh, like I said, my wife, by the grace of her heart, when I came home, that she had taken money out of her savings account because I'm fucking dead broke. Because the cost of living has gone up. My paycheck has gone down because we gave out double time on Sunday. Our insurance went up $20 a week two weeks ago, $20 to $40 a week. And, and, and that's what's happening in the last eight, ten years to the whole fucking country. They've shut down the industry. They've friggin' cut pay. Insurance has gone up. But there is hope, and I'm going to watch it tonight when Bill Clinton gives us an acceptance speech. Because there is hope if we can get this economy going again and start treating people fair and get assholes like you to do something decent instead of picking up some fucking innocent guy that wasn't speeding to begin with. Bye.